Hey, it's Ramsey Dewey over here in Shanghai, China. I got a few questions saying, Hey, Ramsey, have you done the bottle cap challenge? And yeah, I guess so. I went over to my friend TJ's gym and he said, Hey, Ramsey, we got to do this, this bottle thing. And I was like, well, what bottle thing? And so, yeah, we started spin kicking the caps off of bottles, which is shockingly easy to do. If you can reliably throw a spinning hook kick, yeah, you can do that. I think uh, I only accidentally knocked out like um, seven or eight people who were holding the bottle for me before I managed to uh, get the bottle cap off because TJ wanted us to do it with the uh, with a blindfold on for some reason. So uh, yeah, so there's the video. I guess this is a uh, a much better viral challenge in my opinion than a lot of the ones that are going around like. You know, ones that um, promote self-harm and that sort of thing. Um, specifically because, you know, it gets all the all the Taekwondo nerds out there really excited that uh, what they do is finally relevant. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a Taekwondo nerd myself. I get it, guys. I get it. You see people on the internet doing something you can do and you're like, I can do that and I will. So, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't spend too much time kicking bottle caps. There are better ways to train. Speaking of which, thanks for watching. Now get out there and train. Is that the lens? Yeah. Thanks for watching. Now get out there and... Oh, hey, you're probably wondering about you know, these little marks on my face. Uh, so I did some open hand sparring yesterday with... Um, Nils and with Linji over the gym because I was curious. I got a bunch of questions about open hand striking and I spent many years in dojos and dojongs practicing open hand striking at the air, in forms, on targets, on boards, on bricks, things like that, but I realized I'd never actually done any dedicated open hand sparring. And so we, uh, we just you know, we, we could grapple, but also throw open hand strikes, palm strikes, knife hands, ridge hands, all that stuff. And one thing I learned is when you do that, you tend to get fingernails all over your face. <laughs> so, yeah, you're going to get scratched up and cut up if you do a lot of that stuff. Especially if it's any harder than light contact. But yeah, we made a video about that and, and um, yeah, there are a lot of interesting things that I learned and you're going to get very different results depending on who you spar with and what kind of skill set that they have. So, yeah, stay tuned for that one. Thanks for watching. Now get out there and train.